Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're creating this Christmassy silver pigmented look ready for Christmas around the corner. I'm first starting off with my Elemis Pro Collagen Marine Cream. It's so so good for improving the skin's firmness and tone and collagen elastin as well as keeping our skin hydrated and smooth and plump underneath all our makeup. Next I'm using my YSL Blur Primer, this is such a nice primer for smoothing the skin, the pores and just helping your makeup last all day. After that I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Concealer to help carve out my brows and I do that to both brows and around my eyebrows. So after I've carved my, my brows, I'm just using a beauty sponge just to blend in that concealer around the eyebrows. My eyebrows are already microbladed. I'm just going straight in my foundation after. This is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade Sand. I then use my So Suit by Suzanne Jackson brush. Um, so I just use this to blend the foundation into the skin. While blending in, I did notice that my shade was a little bit too light just because I did fake tan the day before. So I'm just using the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Foundation in a darker shade to deepen up my original base. After that, I'm using some translucent powder over the lids, just ready for our eyeshadow. I'm using the Morphe 25 a palette and using a transition shade into the crease first I'm just pushing that back into into the crease before we go in with our pigment this is the peaches and cream Gatsby pigment and I'm using a Mario Badescu spray just onto a brush just to make the pigment more pop in so I just apply that over the lid after I've applied that onto the lid I do go in with a deeper shade just to give depth to the crease of our lid and then after that I go in with my concealer just to conceal underneath my eyes down the bridge of my nose and on top of my forehead so I'm just using my beauty blender again just to bounce that into the skin underneath my eyes and the areas I put my concealer making it seamless into the foundation. I then use my definer brush again just to clean up where my eyeshadow is and just give that sharp look. Also it helps me with my eyeliner later on. I'm using my iconic London stick in the shade 4.1 just to warm up my face in the areas I want to cream contour. This may look crazy at first but trust me when you blend it in it gives your face such nice sort of chiseled look and it's so so gorgeous on the skin after i've done that i just go back in with a beauty sponge just to make sure everything is just blended and looking seamless no harsh lines or anything Using my RCMA Loose Translucent Powder, I'm just pressing that into my skin just so my makeup lasts all day and to set the entire face. I then used my Maybelline Mascara, I did my eyeliner and under eye shadow off camera. While my eyelashes are drying, I just like to do a little bronze and do my nose contour. After that, I'm just applying my lashes because this glue does dry down really, really fast. And these are the Tatty Lashes TL1s. They are so, so nice and my favourite lashes, my go-to at the moment. So I'm just making sure I'm pressing them in just so they're going to be holding there for the entire day and not coming away at any of the edges. After that, I'm going with my ABH bronzer in the shade saddle this is such a nice contour powder this day i don't go by when i'm not using this it's just so so nice just chiseling my cheeks my jaw and my forehead before going in with my powder again just to chisel out my nose contour once again while that's baking and I also do my underneath my um, cheekbone I like to bake that as well Just 
I'm going then in with my MAC Telling Glow blush. This is such a nice rosy ready tinted blush but it's got that nice glitter into it as well and then i'm using my goddess of love by i Heart makeup highlighter i'm just applying this to my cheekbones my cupid's bow and after i knock off my nose um bake i then like to apply it to my tip of my nose and down the bridge as well i also do like to layer my highlighters so i'm going with the ofra cosmetics in blissful these are both rosy toned highlighters which I want to use for this look. After that I'm going to knock off my cheek um, bake with the MAC Studio Fix powder. It's so so good to use sort of like a slightly pigmented powder if you're going to knock off any bake just because it doesn't give you that harsh line. Then for lips I use the um, Collection Nude Pink Liner with the Venus by Lipland Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick. Just pressing that in with my finger to give that ombre effect before finishing off with any facial sprays. I do use the aloe, cucumber and green tea spray before then going in with my Urban Decay All Nighter setting spray. So this is the finished look. It's sort of a Christmassy vibe, silver glitter pigmented look. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts and like, comment. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.